All right, guys, the Iceman here on the Jeffrey Rose YouTube channel, a.k.a. the Iceman V2013, with another video, the man with the plan, the man with the knowledge, and guess what? All right, here we go. Another video, CM Punk style. All right, we all know CM Punk left after the Royal Rumble this past year, okay? So... CM Punk's been gone since late January. AJ Lee made it to WrestleMania, defended her Divas title. Monday Night Raw the following night loses the Divas title to Paige. AJ Lee's gone. Shows up late June in Hartford, Connecticut on Monday Night Raw. Comes out, gets a title match with Paige gets her Divas belt back. Now, a lot of people were thinking, with all the surprises going on last Monday night on Raw, that is it possible CM Punk's going to show up? No. I, I, in, in no no idea in the back of my mind did I think that CM Punk was going to show up on Monday night Raw. It would have been nice, but I didn't think so. Um, but I, what I do think here is, for a man that's wrestled for so many years... And most people on your everyday jobs that you do, you know, five days a week, all year long, everybody earns a vacation. Yeah, you can say, well, CM Punk got a vacation last year after WrestleMania when uh, he was gone for a couple months. But was that really a vacation? That was just to mend his body back. This guy was brutally beaten and battered. And let's face it, people in the wrestling business don't have a normal life, and they don't. Uh, they don't get to do the outside things that they would like to do. And for CM Punk, a guy that has his own mind, a guy that really, for the most part, will undermine authority, and he has done so so many times in the past, decided, hey, enough is enough. I'm leaving WWE. He was unhappy with the product. He was unhappy where his direction was going. Uh, granted, he was champion for 434 days. He topped out in the modern name, day era of John Cena's, I believe it was 383. Um, but he needed time. He needed time to do some things in life that he hasn't had an opportunity to do. And, you know, as we all know, doing our everyday job. We all want vacations. And when we get our vacations, we just want to go out and do what we want to do. Most of us, you know, are damn tired and just want to relax for a while. And it takes a lot out of us to just go and do some of the things that, you know, we'd like to do. And most of us can't do the things that we wish we could do because we can't afford it or whatnot. Well, CM Punk's in that different situation. Uh, he has plenty of money. He's very thrifty with his money. He knows. He 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 basically knows how to spend. And he recently was married to AJ Lee in June. They had their little honeymoon in Hawaii. So AJ says it's time for me to go back to work. And she showed up at a very unexpected time on Monday Night Raw, which brought the fans, you know, really to their feet. Now with CM Punk. A lot of people are saying, oh, he'll probably show up at SummerSlam. Or he'll probably show up at the United Champions. Or maybe TLC, maybe Survivor Series. I don't see CM Punk coming back for the rest of this year. But I will say this. I'm putting it on record. CM Punk left at the Royal Rumble. I believe CM Punk will return at the 2015 Royal Rumble. And, yeah, he'll have a year off. People are going to say, well, the guy won't be in shape. Is this? But let me tell you something. This guy stays in shape. Uh, we've seen him jogging out in Hawaii with A.J. Lee, which sort of like nicks the rumors of A.J. Lee being pregnant. Uh, and if she was pregnant, she wouldn't be coming back and she wouldn't get the Divas title. Wouldn't have made no sense. 
So again, a lot of rumors out there are just false rumors and we all fall for them. I do myself. But I do think that CM Punk will return into the WWE and I do believe when he does, it will be at the Royal Rumble in which where he left the WWE. Now, a lot of people were saying once Punk left, they were happy he was gone. For me, no. Because I saw the difference in the WWE product once CM Punk left. I saw the scrambling going around by the WWE management to try to refocus and, and, and reform matches for WrestleMania because CM Punk was gone. If CM Punk was around, would Daniel Bryan have gone and won the WWE World Heavyweight Champion at WrestleMania? I don't think so. I think it would have been a whole new ball game. So, with the departure of Punk, it helped out Daniel Bryan. As I said in another video on my other channel, with the departure of Daniel Bryan, it's helping out other superstars, and I honestly do believe that. But I do honestly believe CM Punk will be back, and I do think it's going to be at the Rumble, and I think this is going to be where we all get shocked. Of course, I'm sure there'll be rumors coming out prior to that and whatnot, but here it is. It is July 7th, 2014. The Iceman has said it first that Punk will return at the Royal Rumble. So, you can like it, you can hate it. You can love Punk, you can hate Punk. You can love the WWE, you can hate the WWE. But I will say this, the WWE is much better with CM Punk than without him. And rest assured, if and when CM Punk does return, we're gonna see a pipe bomb like no other. And I'm looking forward to it. I'm hoping to see it. I think I will see it. Uh, I think all you wrestling fans out there that uh, really could care less about CM Punk are lying to yourselves because you know damn well that the product isn't as good without CM Punk on the roster. So these are my thoughts. These are my opinions for this Monday. This is the Iceman on the Jeffrey Rose YouTube channel. Peace out, everybody. Have yourself a great day.